That's recording. All right, um, we're going to sync this up when I announce that, that this is a role-playing game session for the CKC crew featuring uh, Draco Raylan as the main ST. We have Stripe Protector uh, as the Stripe Protector, Evil Zhek as uh, Arosa, and we have Desk King who is playing as Caden Tyrell. All right, uh, this game is fiction and used for entertainment purposes only. It does feature some very disturbing images of people being torn in half, ripped apart, and, of course, werewolves. It's the world of darkness. So if we are all ready to begin, we will set up. So are you guys ready to set? get ready to begin? Yep. All right. I am. Yeah. Let's do this. I, think I, oh, I remember yeah. where we left off, right? We were all running right. from spiders, Currently, I think. Yeah, no. this is right. Uh, currently, uh, oh. Hyena, Striped, you've uh, listened up and caught up with us on the actual uh, podcast so far, so you have a good idea of where we're at. Um, right yeah. now, the three of you, Striped, you're currently out cold. You're slowly coming to in a metal cage, being currently being carried by Caden, who is, De- who is uh, Desi King's character. You guys are currently in the Umbra, the spirit world, in the middle of the city. Skyscrapers and all the buildings around you look stale, look dirty, look sick, and you can see strands of spider webs uh, connecting between various points throughout the buildings, the pathways, the walkways, everywhere. And behind you on the building you just narrowly escaped from, you see three metallic, funky kind of disjointed but still completely whole spider spirits notice you and one of them says that they have interfered after them oh sh- oh shit not this again oh my god that Shush. was so cheesy god. remember I'm a storyteller I control your lives uh, alright so Dez and Evil I'm going to oh. give you what? This is a chase. And this is also to kind of help you guys remember the dice roll system. So, you're going to be outrunning okay. spider spirits. And one, two, three, four. Okay. Now, you're going to have to make some dexterity plus stealth or athletics if you want to try and gain some distance on them. You can make whichever roll you want to do if you want uh. to be sneaky about it. Dez, you're currently at a negative four, and your difficulty is increased by two. So you have so you subtract four dice from your dice pool, and your difficulty is going to be increased by two. Okay, uh, how many how many signs were you rolled? You rolled ten right? sided dice. Now, w- what are you using? Uh, are you using dex okay, and I... stealth, or are you going to use dex and athletics? I will give you guys uh, a choice of that option, whichever well, one is easier for you. Well... To do. All right, I'm doing stealth and dex. athletics. It'd be dex and athletics. Okay. okay. Let me, oh, let dexterity. Me do... Yeah. Okay. Dex and athletics. <laughs> so that's... Uh, okay. okay. Um, Which are you going to use? Athletics yes. or stealth? Well, depending on... Since yes. I'm still in yes, my crinos form, right? Um, Hold on. Let me just make sure, let me just make sure I, I got the sheet with my crinos with all my, you know, my class information. Oh. Uh, all right, I think I'm, I think I'm gonna what, go with. I think I'm gonna go with. I think I'm gonna go with. I think I'm gonna go and right, try so to be Dex sneaky about it. So you add up your dexterity mm-hmm. plus your stealth. That's going to be your dice pool. You're going to subtract four dice from that, and then your difficulty for this is going to be increased by two, so it's going to be an eight. Okay. No, so you I do roll not roll eight, eight dice. Am I still in my roll, lupus? What's your dexterity plus your stealth? My dex plus my dex plus stealth is... That's five total? Spine. Okay. You're going to subtract four dice from that roll. You're at one. One, basically. You have to get an eight or higher to get a success on this roll. And you can spend willpower. So I got number... I roll... So I got one... I got... Yes. I got one dice to roll, right? You fail this. And remember, you can spend you can spend willpower to get an instant success on any roll. Uh, I think I'm gonna as much as I hate to do this, I'm All gonna right, have to so go with willpower. willpower so you have an automatic su- success. Roll your one dice. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I, 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 how many rolls right are roll? roll? What? And this is the first roll. I want to give you guys two rolls. Oh. Okay. Number of Evil, rolls. Do you have your dice pool? Uh huh. I roll. Uh, how many? Yeah. Oh, my bad. Yes, I, I, I roll have. One. My bad. Yes. Am, am I still in my lupus form? All right. So. Ah. Uh. It's a five. I have. It, I and have an eight. So. Yeah, and then I have two, a minus plus, two. Plus, if you're mauled, you're going to have negatives yes. from that as well. Um, how many, how many, this how many is rolls the first roll do I have? This is only one right now. One roll, huh? So I have. Dang it, I lost it. So I have eight, and then minus and two minus for two being mauled. To a dex or witch roll, so that's a negative four. So you have four dice to roll. Um, how many dice do I roll? I mean, I draw okay. one, right? Yes, yes. You you have one dice to roll for this, due to the penalties right. on top of you. And number, of, and num and the number of rolls is There's one, gonna right? There's two total rolls, but I'm gonna do both of you guys rolling them at the same time, so, you get, so you guys have an idea Excuse of how me. well or bad you're doing. Okay. That's that. I just I just wanted to make sure. I know we're, I'm only rolling one dice, but I didn't know. I can't remember how much I was roll. How many how many rolls I was doing. Right. Okay. I got I got my rolls. I got I got, I got okay. a five so and an got, eight. You spent willpower on one of those rolls, so you've got two successes. Evil, what do you got? I have a two, a six. A All right, six, you've got three. You eight. don't have a, you don't have an increased penalty to yours, so you're rolling at a DC six. So you got three successes, or yeah, three successes there. Uh, I, I, excuse me. I'm sorry. It just I couldn't. My bad. So um, basically um, I the number my I only got in, uh, the number of rolls. Yes, the number is two, of rolls right? is two, Des, and you've already rolled twice. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay, uh, that. okay. All right. Evil. Give me another roll. Same dice pool. Same modifiers. Um. Yeah. So four again. The DC is a six. Um, uh, I got a nine, a three, a five, All right. and a nine. So Des, you got six successes, or not Des? Evil, you got six successes. Des, you got two. Now, Evil, I want to ask a very simple question: Are you helping Des move that box that he's carrying? Okay, so you're helping. Yes. Your guys' combined totals surpass the combined totals of the spiders that are chasing you. So you basically start booking it. Evil, you basically help guide Dez through a couple of back alleys as you guys burst out into the spirit world of the street. It's barren. Now, Evil, Arosa, Arosa is Hamid. You've seen cities. They're busy. They're messy. They're crowded. This is weird. It's extremely weird to see the spirits. Hey, you gotta remember. Yes, you hate white people. Remember, I hate white people. Because you're a Wendigo. But <laughs> you, come, you guys burst out in the street, there are no cars in the Umbra at all. It's almost post-apocalyptic. It's just creepy how the skyscrapers and buildings seem to stare back at you on this empty street. So you run down the street as you hear the click, 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 click of the spider coming after you, running after you. And they're going along the webs that are connecting the buildings together. Then you take another right. At this point, you don't know where exactly, you don't have any idea where you're going at all. All you know is that it's away from those things. So you round a corner and then down another alley and you wait. And you wait. You hear the of the spiders as they kind of rush by, running, skittering as they mumble about finding you and taking back their prize. God, I hate you guys wait. You guys wait for a couple minutes? You guys wait for about five, ten minutes or so? And you hear nothing. Striped. You start to wake up. Yes. And you are very uncomfortable. You're almost laying on your head at an angle. And you have a really bad headache. Yeah. 
Ah. And as you wake up, you realize that you're in, you're in a very hard, cold box. And you hear heavy breathing coming outside, just outside the box. So what do you do? Well, okay, let me see. Uh, okay, I ask, where am I? Who's that breathing? And what's Guys, going on? You're shut up, shut up, shut up, man, dude, shut up. But we'll get to that part later if we do. Right now, I don't want to be cocooned in here for eternity. So please shut up, before I knock you out again. <laughs> God, I hate spiders. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'll be quiet. I promise. You guys, wait a little bit longer. Nothing. You guys, take a quick look outside. Try and see him. Don't see him at all. Are they gone? Looks clear. Are they gone? All right. Just to be safe, I, I vote we go around another. We go around another. I find another exit just to make sure they don't be waiting All right. for us outside. You guys are going to t navigate the Spirit Umbra of the city, and I gotta double check some character sheets to see what would be applicable here. Uh, hey, do you have a copy of my Not character sheet, Benny, me. or you know? I'm just looking at the basic character sheet in the uh. back of this book. Um. I'm going to allow uh, either. Actually, I'm going to in, allow an intelligence, and either streetwise or occult. Your choice. Intelligence. Street. I mean, like streetwise. Hmm. Who's who's navigating and who's carrying at yes. this point? Yes. I'm still carrying Strahinius drugged. And I'm still carrying him. And good news, I finally found right. my full character sheet. The I have I the box. Well, the box is what Hyena is currently in that Dez is currently carrying. Ah. Uh, yes, and you're getting... Right. Hey, good, good, good. Uh, what form is He's Hyena in? His in form. Out of Lupus. If I remember correctly. Ah. Uh, well, good thing... Well, that's maybe it's a good thing he sold. I do light, believe cause... you are a Lupus, right? Right, right striped? Okay, all right. That's yeah, that makes sense. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Huh. Hey, hey, Denny. I had a question. Which is your favorite? Um. Uh, eh, I've I use the forms as they are useful in current contextual situations. I think he means by design. Kind of like Hispo. I'm, me too. I was it's, looking it's, into it's, this stuff. It's a tie for me. It's a tie between Glabro right. and his. Des, you're looking around. Intelligence and either Streetwise or Occult, whichever you have in there, because it is navigating a city. But you are a Lupus. Okay, I want to. I I want since I since I don't have much street since I don't have much well Streetwise. Obviously, I think I'm gonna try All to right. go off intelligence, intelligence on this. One. You gonna go straight Intelligence, or are you gonna? I'll allow. Uh, I'll allow Primal Urge. Since you're a lupus born, if you want to add that to the role as well, um, explain to me what that is Primal again. I mean, like it has been a while. Into your instincts, so you can tell, so you can help, so uh, you can try and I, get a feel for what's going on. Basically, t going into your instincts. Okay, as well. Ah, uh, well, I think I want to add that to the role too because basically, um. Basically, I got I got more of that than I have. Well, street wise, I got. All right. So, so I'm gonna have to go plus with that. Wise, I'm going to give you a. It's I have, gonna be a, I have Z. It's gonna be a Sorry. plus one difficulty. So no, that take plus one means that your DC right? is higher, so your DC is a seven. Okay, number of so my the number of my number of roll my dice rolls is seven. What's your seven dice, right? Merge? Um, and ah, uh, intelligence, intelligence plus prime urge is um okay, pretty so much you roll seven, seven dice. Seven. The target number you're hitting is seven. One. So how many rolls? Yes, one roll. I got a nine, a nine, All right, got and three an eight. successes. 
judging by the direction the spiders were going, you were pretty sure that the opposite direction, but also not going back to the place you were running from. And maybe a little bit south. Be a better option. So you lead them so you lead them all until you find kind of a little hideaway hole, avoiding some of the other kind of gnarly spirits you start to see that are kind of grow in the city. And they're really, really gnarly. So you avoid those and you find kind of a safe little sanctuary you guys can wait out in. It's not much, it's not completely hundred percent safe, but it's better than what you've had. Uh, well, guys, well, here's a little hidey hole I think I scoured about. It's better than my, well, I gotta give some credit. It's better than my room, better than my room back home. <laughs> Make yourselves at home and try not, try not to, to cause so much noise, okay? Stripe, they're talking to you. They're saying it's safe. Okay. Now that we're safe, may I have current, my answers? Striped, you're, striped, you're currently Very in well. What's your first... You're in a cage, actually. You're still in a well, cage. <laughs> For starters, for starters, for starters, good sir, you're in a cage, um, and I just personally spent we, me and my compatriots here, have just spent the last day saving your ass. I, I, I believe a thank you would be in order first. My many thanks, friends. Wait a second. I thought we were looking for um, um, newborn. You're looking for kinfolk. Um, I, I thought we were. I thought it was glad. I thought it was technically the glass it's kinfolk actually. of both. Glasswalkers and Red uh, Talons you've been looking for. However, you don't uh, know which one Striped is. Uh -huh. You don't even know. His, you don't even know his name. You don't even know what he looks like. He's still in a box. Ah, uh, so good. So can I open the box? Um, I'm still a lupus, right. so I think I'm just gonna. Br I'm thinking I'm just gonna bust yes, it you open. Can. You can rip it open. I mean, give Krino. me a willpower roll. My bad. I <laughs> So, so wait. Can I can I this, just do this with like brute strength, strength or work this way in World of Darkness? Is you roll your willpower and that adds to your strength rating. Ah. Uh, hey, hey. Can I use can I use uh, a gift, gift to help him out? <clears throat> yes. Uh, inspiration. Inspire. How are you inspiring your friend to open up a box? Um, I'm going to. <laughs> Yell at him and tell him he's doing a great job. Tell him I tell me I want. Tell me I gotta want it. You gotta want it. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Inspirations effects. Okay. Oh god, I need to look this. I need to look this up. Let's see. Moral support. Moral support um, right here. Okay, my my strength plus my willpower is a, my my willpower right, so is a six, six at dice. the moment. DC is a six. Okay, my yeah, is a DC, six, right? you, have to, you have to roll six dice and get a six on them to be a success. Yes, or higher. A six. Okay, here's what I got. I got a seven, All right, a ten, success. a nine, and a nine. Your, your strength is officially three higher than it was. So let me see. Inspiration. All right. All right. You grab with your massive Krinos hands and stripe. This is what you see. Five claws puncture through the front mm. door, or maybe the back door. You don't know which. You don't know which side is up in this thing. It, it's been tossed around so much, and the it crunches and then rips right out. And you see a tall Krinos werewolf and a, another loop. What you presume is a lupus werewolf because they were speaking Garu, Dez, and then Evil. Describe yourselves to Striped, and then Striped. Describe yourself to uh, these two lugheads. Uh, well, I am, I am, I am Caden Terrell, badass spirit wolf at your service. Um, that's that's your cue, friend. Introduce yourself. I'm Aenosa. Um, I am a warrior, and I'm a Wendigo. Striped. Hello, hello, friends. I'm called the Strap Protector. As you can see, the strict. The six stripes across my back. I got these in a fierce battle, protecting. <laughs> you're, you're uh, what was protecting it again, Denny? Uh, that was sigil protecting against the agents of the worm. <laughs> okay. My bad. New moment. I'm so sorry. 
Anyway, predicting a sigil. You're going to edit no. all this out <laughs> right later, right? You know, I'm, oh, I'm just going to be really, I'm just going to be really stupid instead of saying the worm. I'm going to say the caterpillar. God, please don't. Do I'm that. sorry, guys. I'm just completely new moment over here. It makes it fun though. Anyway, protecting the sigil, and this is where the I got claw marks, and from where the fur has grown back. Those, um, I I get that looked at for I get that looked at because I get that looked at for you because I'm starting to I'm starting to see some flies starting to grow in there. Ew. What? That's not that's not even something to say. That's nasty. Anyway, I have a question yeah. for Striped. Yes, I promise I'll do, do better. Do those stripes? Do those stripes show up in any yes. form you're in? They are scars. Yes, they they show up in all forms. In his human, they are no. they show up as scars in his human and globro forms. In yeah. his wolf forms, they show as yeah. just col the fur grew back a different color. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Ah, uh, okay. answer time. All right. Mind if I explain? Right, let's go. All right. So earlier today, I I sat out on my own. Thought I'd say, "Hey, see, live the adventure, taste the taste the glory." Now, long story short, from my side of story, all I'm tasting is bullets and blood in my mouth, but and ground. But basically. I ran. I basically, so basically, we basically, I ran into these guys, and basically, after a bit of a, just to say a debacle, we we realized some of our kinfolk are going missing, and and that that little adventure led us to a warehouse where we found you. Now, here's what was odd: they, there were humans there. And then we, when we finally got spotted, they didn't they didn't run. And as y'all know, usually when we transform, they run. They usually run with their they run with their non-existent tails between their legs. Uh, personally, in my opinion, I think it might be some kind of werewolf black market. Hmm. Uh, a black mar um either either that or if they they've not or they either that if they're learning they've learned of our existence. And they're trying to yeah. find out more about us. But there's one thing we need to do right now. We need to turn into Hobbits. We, we need to go to a hospital so I can get these bullets side out note. of me. Storyteller, side note. Those bullets will fall out. You heal lethal damage at a rate of about 1 every 15 minutes. So you guys have actually healed a level of damage already. And hospitals with Garu healing, not a good idea. I mean, like, first of all, we have no human hit. We're not humans. We have no human history, and the, the humans require this thing. I I heard people, I like, say, what do you know? What is insurance? What insurance. is this insurance? Uh, is some... Do you guys think we should maybe go back and investigate that back? Um, the um investigate where we had got to running from a giant robot with silver bullets and knives packing. Yeah. It, it's, um, the sun's coming up right now, and they'll probably be gone. If we uh, can make it safely, then I say we should at least try. Indeed, I I say we yeah. I say we get at least I say we get at least an hour and rest, and one of us should be on watch. Yeah, but before. Let's go to Taco Bell. Totally. <laughs> what is what is oh, this Taco? Good. What is this Taco Bell? I am. I we went I, to Taco Bell. In he the wasn't first there session. for that. I remember that. He wasn't there for that scene. Oh, what is, again, Taco what Bell is this? Session. What is this? What is these tacos? Are they some? Are they some? Are they some kind of? Are they some kind of weapon that will help us in our quest? No, it's food. Sadly, no. I've heard of these things. And though I am uncertain of what they are, I've heard it is a human snack thing. It better not. It better not have. It better. It better not have it, silver in it. It's a flatbread with meat with beef, beef, um, cheese. Something called lettuce. Lettuce. 
Yeah, a type of vegetable. And uh, fire sauce. Um, uh, or why would you eat? How can why would we eat? fire? Why would you eat all that? When that? Wait. It's 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 a spice. Wait. And then, or you could get special things like a volcano burrito. Wait. Which volcano bur? Wait. They get this. They get these things out of a volcano. No. No, it's oh. just another type of spice. Uh, I was about to say, man. Freaking risky just to get something to eat. Anyway. Alright, uh, anyway. How the quiet are you guys being Time. as you guys discuss tacos? Whispering. We're whispering as quiet as we po as a, as two whoopers and a cryos can possibly can. We may be talking loudly. Oh, really? Here. Trust me. We're really? <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> and that's where and, the storyteller and, goes. And, no. and, and Questions of volcano burritos no. and fire sauce. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, okay. We're sorry. The weaver, the weaver is an evil spirit probably listening outside wondering what the right. hell are we talking about. Let me see about getting some perception and alertness from you guys. Okay. Um, did anyone else hear nah, that creaking you sound? You have to make the roll before oh. I tell you if you hear or notice anything. That's the way this works. Ew. Let me let's do oh, it. I thought he was talking about the uh, oh. actual sound I heard. No, I thought he was talking about the game. Always, oh, my it, the wind's blowing. My house is creaking like hell. This sounds literally every five to ten minutes. So if I hear if you hear something weird in the background, just ignore okay. it. That's what's doing. All right. So perception and alertness from everyone. And since we have two loot, okay. Actually, evil said he shifted Muhammad. Um, I, um, I need, um, okay, I just, ro I just rolled, I, um, I just rolled a five. Okay, I, um, the number of dice to roll is the five, right? Because that. What? What happens? He, he, he his hit toe. his toe. toe. Oh. You okay, uh, man? Oh, it's kind of bleeding. Oh, jeez. I've done that multiple times. Like, once in PE class, you're playing kickball. And I kicked it, and my foot slid across the ground. And oh I God! Took my shoe off, and it was like. Uh, Alrighty then. Okay. And I, TMI. TMI. Yeah, too much information. Uh, and, All right, so. I. Am. All right. Perception alertness now for anyone in lupus, which is striped currently. You have a neg your difficulty is going to be a four because you're in lupus. And Des doesn't get any modifi doesn't get any modifiers for his perception. Um, and neither does Evil, if he's currently still around and not bleeding out uh, his toe. Um, my perception, my perception. Oh, yeah. I, I should probably right, go wash. Go ahead. You'll, we'll have space you for a bit. It's fine. My perception alertness is Evil is I roll. Five, I just got to rolling five die a few moments ago. I was just right, waiting for things to quiet down. I got, I, holy crap, I got a 10, a 5, a All 7, right, so a 7, successes. and a 7. Uh, Striped, what about you? Oh, oh, um. All right, for this, game, for, for this game, you roll your, the number of points you have in perception, plus the number of points you have in alertness, that's your dice pool. That's, you roll okay. that many 10-sided dice. Anyway, I'm using that um, yep. dice and roller it thing. It works. It's pretty pretty randomized, so so it's working pretty well for everyone. Okay, so number number of dice rolls. Number of would dice be, rolled um, is however much your perception and alertness is. Okay, you, so what would I put, uh, put yeah, for that? Yeah, that's eight. the one you have. Then eight. Alertness, alertness. I am super confused right now. You want me to walk him through it, even though I, you know, even though I'm a little rusty, I still know. Basically, you got, you got, you're on that road dice online, right? Yeah. 
okay, the number of sites you roll is 10, and you have negative, and you, and right now, considering from what I've heard from Denny, no. you're going to roll four no, dice. No, he's rolling and eight dice. Is... The difficulty number that he needs to hit is four. Oh, now yes. I remember. He needs to get a four or higher, basically. Okay, so number of rolls is eight, and the, nu- and the number of rolls is one, and the number of dice you roll is eight. Okay. Hmm. Well, he does that. Hey, Denny. Um, any updates on, or did you even start? I was going to do the sketches tonight Sicilian. when we're done, and get those out of the way before Christmas. Uh, okay. Right. Anyway, oh, it says and like, another thing. Oh, go ahead. Okay, it says like the result is like a one, a one, a three, a three, a ten, a five. Okay, another so five and an eight. How many above four? Okay, and you got two ones. Four. One in the system, two. if you yeah. roll a one, so, removes, it removes a success. So it removes the highest number okay. first, so it removes the ten, and then the eight. If I remember right, you had said you had an eight. So your current successes are two, okay, yeah. with two fives. Now yeah. I will point out that if you roll yeah. and you get no successes, and a one it is called a botch. That is a worst case scenario. Okay. I'm waiting for people to botch. All right, it's basically, basically in a botch when you're trying to hear something, you're basically yeah, you're, or deaf you're distracted by something else completely to the point where you are so distracted that you are oblivious to the knife at your throat. Yeah. Ooh, okay, yeah, shiny yeah. red ball. Of course, we got two successes, okay. and we got so, four successes from okay, Dez. Yeah. You guys, mm-hmm. well, Dez, you hear this a little bit more. You're. you're you're at evil. If you've got a chance to roll, go ahead and roll for it. Okay, so basically, I'm not hear, I'm not hearing the um thing. Just exactly. Like, as he's well got as more Dez's. successes, therefore he's got a higher okay. chance of hearing something. Especially if I say okay. that he needs a certain amount of successes to succeed. Okay. Again, you, I want to apologize. I'm to the first sorry. Couple this sessions, is like the first game. What, like. Perception and okay. alertness. What am I rolling? What am I rolling for? Perception and alertness. All right. All I need is is evil's numbers, and I can actually get to the next point. I got I, those together. I have a five. You're in Hamid. Plus, I'm in. So no, no change. Yeah. So nothing. All right. So, roll so five I have dice, a five. Anything above a six. Ten. Okay. Five. I'm learning. Oh shit! God damn it. All right, all right. I fixed it. I actually hit the wrong number. Um, one, a nine, a six, an all right, eight, so and a you five. Get two successes. Two successes. You're kind of in the same boat as uh, Striped. All right, so Des, you're the only one that hears this. Yeah. It's a faint, odd thrumming now. Just a consistent droning thrum, like. It's very, very faint, exceedingly faint, almost as if. No, it exists, but you don't know where it's from, and it seems to come from everywhere and yet nowhere at once. And it just seems like someone's talking, and you want to hear them. Okay, guys, guys, I hear something. What do you hear? It's rummy. Kind of my stomach. No, it's not. No, that's some. No, that's something else. This is more of a thrumming sound. It, what it's, thrumming I, sound? I don't know. It, I don't know. It's like it's coming from everywhere and nowhere at once. But anyway, shh. shh. I, I don't, hear, I don't hear, hear anything. I, no, I'm, I don't. I'm not, I'm not going crazy or anything. I, I swear to the both of you. There's some. There's some kind of sound. Straight and evil. You don't hear the thrumming. I think you're crazy. Yeah. But you do hear... Yeah, I know. It's not so much hear this. You smell this. Because alertness appeals to all five senses. You guys smell... Yeah, okay. Almost... It, it, it smells like fur. It smells like fur. It's not you guys, not sure any not you guys in this area. It smells like fur that's been almost sterilized. Like it has a it has a scent as fur. Whoa, so like tame. But it's it it's it's still. 
It's like it's frozen in time almost. Right, oh, I think I know what it is. Some kind of coat or something like that. Oh no, now, Des, bro. You hear it. You hear this droning sound start to get louder, but it's not getting any more de decipherable. Uh oh, great! Now it's getting louder. You, are you telling me you still can't hear it? No, I can't hear shit. I don't see anything because I'm just in alert mode, just like turning turning my head, just trying to spot whatever it is. All right, you is. guys, Des, something's coming. Okay, I, I'm telling you, I hear something. You may not. You just be ready. Now, something Des, you hear? Right. Are you gonna you gonna be stealthy about this or? What are you guys doing exactly? Um, I, 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 I say we, I say, I say we should, I say we should, I say we should be quiet and break and brace for impact. Wolfkin is here. Wolfkin. All right. Finally. Ha! Late to the late to the party. Hi, Wolf. Hi. Hey, man. I went, What's up? I went through two sprites. Already. All right, Wolf. Wolf. You okay? Okay, say that again, Wolf. Uh, alright, who wants to take this? Uh, hi Hyena, I'm you free. are the newbie. You recount what has happened. You recount what has happened in the session so far for Wolf. Oh, God. Do I Why me? Why can't it be me and the other two? Come on. You're the new man. I'll new do it. Like, I'll add. I'll add along. Okay, evil, recount. Go into storyteller mode. Come on, recount. Uh, we escaped so, the spiders. We were. Hey, shut your mouth. I thought I was saying it. So, you're running away from spiders, and uh, Death's Row was kind of falling behind a bit, and I helped him haul his butt out of there. And then we opened this box in some alleyway, and um, Striped popped out. I'm free. And then uh, we started talking to him, getting some answers and stuff. And then uh, Death's Row started to hear this loud noise that none of us can hear and we smell something it's kind of like fur but it's still it's been sterilized and it's getting louder and that's where you come in congratulations you're out of hammer space all right wolfkin so let's get you jump let's get you jump back in i need a perception alertness roll from you too okay Give me a second. I need to open up the. No, we've got it in the Skype chat for you. It's good to go. All right. I already have one favorited. The insanity wolf is in. Mm. Perception and alertness. And alertness. DC six. I forgot what moon phase it is. Okay. Ugh. Okay, I got a ten, a All right, nine, four successes. a six, and an eight. You're on the same level as Des, but however, you don't hear... Well, you hear it. You hear this light drumming, almost <coughs> pulsing, thrumming sound in the back of your ears and it, you know it's here and it's been getting louder and louder almost as if something's getting closer but you can't understand what the sound is it's almost like someone is talking to you and beckoning you to them but you can't understand exactly what it is but you can tell that the sound is getting closer here i can do the sound you realize i'm the third right the you don't understand what it says stuff. Oh, okay, really? back. back. That is scary. It's okay. almost but you are a third. I will give you a. Uh, we'll give you an intelligence and a cult roll really quick. DC eight. Okay. Can you speak up or mess with your mic a little bit? Because it's hard to hear you. I'm losing my voice, right? You're echoing a bit too. I'm sorry. Echo's not that bad. Yep. Yeah. 
Well, we must hear your insanity. Yeah. Draco. I can't be... say it again. What did I need to be uh, above? Above a DC, above an eight. Oh, I got an eight. Everything else. You know, is you've below. heard tales about this, warnings <laughs> about this. It's supposed to be the enticing one song of the Weaver. Ooh. And it's getting closer. Let's get out of here. Uh, okay, I hear it too. Uh, okay, finally, someone else other than me hears this. Let's get the hell up out of here for we end up skin coats in this All right, dimension. so how are you guys getting out of there? I vote, I vote, I vote Wolf can haul our, haul our asses and haul our asses well, out of the spirit can, realm can and cross turn the into comets. Bear in mind, he just helped you get the box through. Okay, I vote we cross the gauntlet and we take Hamid and blend in for a bit. How are we going to blend in when we have no clothes? We, um, can we just, um, um, just, bar just, bar just, rip just take them for some humans, like, they, uh, not like they need them. Did I miss anything? What? <laughs> I didn't hear that at all. Me neither. Nope. Did I miss I'm, again, I'm losing my voice, but right. I'm very hard to hear right now. Uh, well, basically, uh, um, I say when we get to the, sir, we get we to the human cross room. The we cross the gauntlet in an alleyway, and we mug someone. That's what That's what I was basically trying to say. I know. I was uh, making it shorter. Oh. <laughs> that's, basically, that's basically what I say we All right, so crossing the gauntlet is a gnosis roll. The difficulty, so you roll your permanent gnosis, so your dots of gnosis, and the difficulty in this si S system for you, if I can, if I remember correctly, is going to be like a DC seven. You're in the middle of Seattle. Bear in mind, and the gauntlet is always thicker where the weaver is strongest. Dang. So across the gauntlet is going to cost what you're going to have to roll. Your permanent points, your circles of gnosis. So for me, everyone has problem. to roll for themselves. Ah. Okay. Uh, so got any eight, 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 nine. I got a nine right, so and three eight successes. And a nine. You get one success. You're going through. Yay! How many? Okay, Des, you got three yes. striped. I just wrote the same thing I wrote last time. Which was um a ten on a ten side die and um number of die dice to roll is an eight and a number of rolls is a one. Yeah, well what's your permanent gnosis? What's the circles of gnosis? I know your gnosis isn't that high. Gnosis um let me see. Uh, was that machine, under again? Bottom center. Center of the shoe. Okay, very center bottom of the sheet. You have what? rage, gnosis, and willpower. No, okay, roses yeah. is above willpower and it's so underneath circles, rage. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Your circles <laughs> and gnosis are what you roll. So how many circles of gnosis do you have? Roll three dice. Three. Okay, my bad. And I believe the DC was a seven, so anything above a seven is a success. You got a ten? Did you I got any ten. ones? Yeah. All right. No. All right. It's like a ten, no. a six, One success, six. you're going through. Evil, did you roll? Did you roll Gnosis to cross the gauntlet? What? What? Yes, I was about to say, what's evil doing about this? Sorry, I'm looking at stuff. Well, I only you have roll one, one dice. Dice. Alright. Better not fail. Roll. Seven or higher. What am I going for? Oh, shit. Alright, you failed. You can, you can roll again, but the difficulty is going to be an eight. 
right. All right, I'm going to try again. All right. Modifier 8. All right, congratulations. I got an 8. You're going through. Right. Basically, you kind of state, you kind of try to, you try to cross your eyes like you're looking at a stere, at a stereoscope, or stereoscope picture, and it just didn't work. And you kind of grunt and growl, and then you finally manage to push yourself through. All right, Des and Wolf, you guys come through in about 15 seconds. So you guys feel yourselves kind of get kind of being pulled through and pushing through the gauntlet as if you're standing in place but the whole world is moving around you only the world moving around you is made of spider webs for striped and evil it takes you about a yeah. minute to get through and let's see you guys are currently in downtown Seattle. You smell the familiar stench of the city. You hear the call and howl of traffic off to the side on the street. You guys, you guys are in the physical world again. Okay. I don't know whether to be blessed or not. What was that? I don't know whether to be blessed or cursed right now. <laughs> I, can, I I say my brother I say it's a little bit of A and B. So what now, guys? What do we do? <laughs> let's, go some, let's go strip. Let's go strip. Let's go strip somebody. Uh, not it. Not it. Not it. I guess evil has to go try and find someone to mug. For clothes or what? Yeah, for clothes. Go beat, go, go, beat, go beat somebody up and take your clothes. Or, or we could be smart about this and... Go into a garbage can and do it? No, no, no. Hear me out, hear me out. Okay. We get some pretty classy clothes, but we break into a store. No. That would draw too much attention. Well, then again, we could go in as a loophole. Hey, I got an idea. Just... How about we rob somebody's house? Oh, that's good. Naked people. But we'd have to be really stealthy about it. I don't have any stealth, so someone else has to do it. Two people, and two people only should do this. While the rest of it, like two others, stand guard. Not me. Not me. I have not stealth. I'm not going. No, nope, I'm not going. In. I'll stand. I'll stand guard. Right. Oh, so, so, so wolf and desert. So it's up to me and wolf, eh? So it's up to me and Wolf, eh? Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Take somebody's. Let's go. Let's go find some guy and strip him naked. Wow, that sounds. That sounds harder. so harder. It's gonna be really harder for me because I have these horns going out of my head. Um. Well, maybe. Well, maybe we can find a hat on the All right. Way so back. you guys are gonna try and find someone to rob. So you can take their clothes for one person that may or may not fit. Is that correct? <laughs> <laughs> yes, All I right, can. <laughs> I can make this work. Uh, uh, hey, wait, wait, wait. Let's rob some extra large people. Yeah, but then they'll be too baggy, and then... Let's just ask everybody what their the size clothes. is. Those yeah, let's just sort of size and rip your shoes clean on. <laughs> right. So, what size clothes do you wear, guys? I um shoe size. I wear a size a size fifteen. Damn. I need to hide my horns. It's all I need. So, uh, I wear a size eight and a half in shoes. Guys, you realize you're not supposed to be going over your actual, actual real life counterparts. These are your characters, mind you. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm. That's why. I'm, that's why I'm doing my my. Like I my, said, in real life, my ten. size is really a twelve. I just I need something to hide the horn. That's all I need. So actually, right. just go with nine. And then in you real life, I wear. Oh no! Just give in for my character. Yeah, you're talking at once. Wolf. 
you're harder to. Gonna, Wolf, you're harder to talk, so you go first. So I can hear you. I'm gonna uh, grab the nearest guy with a hoodie. Okay. I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna. I'm just. I'm gonna knock the nearest guy with a black jacket out with a trash in the middle of downtown Seattle. This is what I've got. Okay. I, I thought we were robbing a house. That, that was my second. Well, which is it? Are you guys gonna just start ru- m- oh. mugging random people? I guess. Best chance. The best chance. Um. Shut. All right. I want to make this quick. You guys are each of your guys are going to need clothes of some sort, but also being a werewolves in downtown Seattle going to be kind of difficult. So. Oh crap! I think we should go, go naked. Human vomit. First. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Go we're, going, we're, going to, we're, we're going to commando today. All right. <laughs> you could you could use the excuse that we're nudists. It's going to um, be hard. I, 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 in the middle have of horns the, in all forms. In the, I have an idea. I have an idea. Yeah. Yeah. You guys can all go uh, lupus form. And pretend to be like dogs and stuff. Yeah, that's I mean, what I guess. Yeah. Or yeah, or we can be smart about it. Read my mind. And just wear something small. Oh. Say we're homeless, oh. and when somebody starts to give us money, we grab them grab. and take them into an alley and steal their clothes. There's a slight problem with that wolf. A lot of people can recognize a wolf. It's kind of hard to pass for a wolf. It's damn, kind of hard for me and wolves damn, to pass for anything else other than wolves. Now, I, I, me and Wolf can basically had the same idea. We were gonna pretend to be wolves. What oh, I'm. I'm like, like being dogs. I'm in my hobbit form. Okay, Denny. What about me? Since we don't normally have stripes, you know. True to an extent, but you still have the body shape and the overall look of a wolf. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, um, Wolfkin, I'm sorry. What were you saying? Uh, I'm kind of stuck in this alleyway until you can get me some kind of clothes. Because, again, in Hamid form, I have horns. I, oh, I yeah, tore up my clothes. I, yeah, and I tore up my clothes in a fight, so I'm naked. I'm I took naked. mine off before I turned. You won't put on your clothes then. But I left them back there. Uh, I'm butt naked, so I need clothes of all Bamboo's going to be in Bamboo. here in a minute, joining us in a minute, guys. Oh, All right, here's a question. Um, I need a D4. Damn. I don't have one on me, so I'll just do a D10. All right, everyone. Okay. Um, Striped is one. Evil is two. Dez is three. And Wolf is four. And if I get a nine or a ten, I'll re-roll. Eight. Okay. Wolf. I want to roll. What's your uh, perception and alertness? Um. Just so I know what. The... I, I know you have five dice. I let two. I want to roll for you just to make sure I can get this along because yeah. this is funny as hell, but still I want to get the story along a little bit more. Okay. You guys, as you guys are hiding in, hi Bamboo. Okay. All right. Oh my volume. The bang is um, here. Helpful. Bamboo. Wait. Whoa. The shoes. Bam, you sound and, uh, weird. Okay. What I missed. All right. This is the second time. Everything. This is the second recap. All oh right. God. The... Quality. I'm volunteer to tell the story. It's not my turn. Everyone sounds me. like a ghost. Oh, me. Like this. I guess. I guess I can. Awful. Recap. My God, I'm lagging. Not oh, too bad. Okay, Bam. Long story short, we're long story short. We ran from spiders. We're in the world now. We're butt naked and we need clothes. And I'm furry. Yes, and hyena. Yes, Mr. Stripe is free from his. You risk. guys have rescued the Stripe protector from. The box with the evil humans that had captured him. Yes, and we're well now we're looking for clothes because uh, yeah, where have I been? Basically, you were you've been with them but haven't interacted with anything. Wait a minute. This is bamboo. Right? bamboo. Do you? I don't know if bamboo has that ritual. I can't remember. I don't know if he does. What? Sure. Yeah, if he has a ritual, sheet. then yes, he will have clothes. If if he doesn't, then he will still have clothes because he basically didn't do anything last last game. 
I have one ritual. RPG character sheet. Oh, okay. I'll just write one. I have like multiple. <laughs> so, all right, Wolf. Oh. Cover from getting shot. What? Uh, the lethal damage um, has I'm healed exactly by now. One. Really? So quick. no one has any damage, and okay. you guys. Des and Wolf, neither of you are at an additional neg four on top of that, so you guys are good. RPG. You guys are at full health, no negatives. Same for you, Evil. Full health, no negatives. The lethal is healed. Yay! Oh, no, what? I have it. I have it, I have it over. Hey, There's so much echo. echo. It helps, it'll help me sync it up a little bit, at least. Provided this time it records. Ah. Uh, yay. All right, so Wolf. As you guys are discussing in this back alleyway about mugging someone, you notice out of the corner of your eye someone shuffling off to the side further down the alley. Guess that's the only one I have of that. Um... Ah, here we are. I'm gonna run nope, after that's them. that's blank. Okay, so you're gonna run after them, Wolf? Thank you. Are, how are, are you gonna stay yeah. inhuman, or are you gonna try and track him down in another form? Uh, I'll try and track him down in, uh, All right. Lupus. Are you gonna quick shift? <laughs> Wolf. Are you gonna quick shift, or are you gonna roll yeah. for it? All right, spend rage. I'll quick shift. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. You guys see Wolfkin's character shift to lupus and bolt down the alleyway. Wolf, you round the corner. Cool. And the next thing you know is there's a massive hand that backhands you into the wall. And then the next... Ow. The, so... So roll Ball master. stamina, because you just got backhanded into the wall. I cannot... Oh, I, I lost it. Oh, dear. I'm going to lose it. I got a right, one, so you, a six, and a two. You soaked one damage. Right. Take three bashing. Bashing. Take so just what? draw a slash. Where is it? There it is. In your health. So oh. just just a horse, okay. just a kind of diagonal slash is bashing. Everyone else, okay. You just heard wolf or something. A heavy body hit the wall. Okay. What? Well, okay. That. What was that? Well, you saw you saw wolf's character run down let's go, that way. Let's go check. Uh, I go running down like... the end of the alleyway and look to see what happens. Okay, so those two. Indeed, let's go. He might be in trouble. Wolfkin, here's I... what here's. So here's Ooh, what I, you guys I see. In the purposes of getting the story moved along, as entertaining as hunting for clothes is. Um, Wolf, you come. You kind of you get a little bit starstruck. It's a little bit of a shock, but you look up and there is a clave pointed at your throat from this person standing before you who's kind of dressed in a cl in a cloak. You can't see their faces. You can't see their face. Oh. But the chin that you can see suggests feminine. Whoever runs around the corner sees Wolf on the ground, a slight dent in the wall, and a cloaked figure holding a clave, a silver weapon that will probably kill all of you or can kill all of you. Pointed at Wolfkin, and I do. I this see. This thing right now. This sounds like a cryptid hunter. Or uh, I see Wolfkin on the ground. A hunter. Okay, I try. I shout out at them and say, "Hey, where are you doing?" The voice you respond is a very strong, solid female voice that says, "One wrong move, and your friend loses his head." 
Okay, do it. Do it. No. No. Yes. You what do better you, not what be do a you werewolf know? hunter. Yeah. Be a werewolf. Okay. okay, you know what? I ask what she wants. Can be a werewolf. They're holy to silver weapon. Hey, 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 um, Danny, I want to, I want to sneak, I want to sneak away for a sec and see. It's just... I'm just imagining we're all holy together like a. I'll be right back. Out, yeah, okay. going over the game plan. While he has the weapon point at his throat, it's kind of humorous. That's, that's why I just I, in my I, head. Yeah. Well, okay. Striped asked a question, which was like, okay, I'm asking her what she's wanting, like you know, what she's here, what she, what she wants from us. Well, and she kind of she kind of looks at you through the cloak, and you kind of see the cloak shifts slightly, and you just see like a set of twin scars running down one of her cheeks, and she's kind of. She, she uh, looks at you with a kind of piercing glare, and you guys can tell this isn't a werewolf hunter. You can feel her rage. She's a werewolf. Because werewolves have weapon. silver weapons. Hey, wait a second. That's not kind of. Okay, Miss Law, I'm just gonna roll with it. I can't hear you, Evil. Oh, sorry, I have my mic away from my mouth. In this universe, are we able to run into things besides yes. like werewolves? I know there's like the were sharks and all that, but I'm talking about like yes, those do exist in the world of darkness and... alongside werewolves. Yeah. Oh, okay. so uh, we could like meet up with some kind could, of demon or something. Awesome. All right, Stripe. She 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 looks at you. Hold. She, her okay. weapon doesn't move anywhere. Doesn't move from Wolfkin's throat. She looks back at you and says, that should be my question. Why did you guys ruin my hunt? Then, okay, I ask. Hunt? I, I, um, I try making live the situation by saying, well, because we're idiots. Um, or, um, or and I'm just sitting in the back trying to assess all of this. Um... Can I, uh, can I talk to I, you? I explain the Stripe situation. I got a question. So, Evil, right. you can... And Bamboo got to say something. Evil. Um, I'm going to talk to the chick. The, what are you going to say? Werewolf chick, and I'm saying, um... Hmm. I am going to say that... Um, where we were recently in um, a small fight. Not letting out too much detail, a small fight, and we were looking for clothes, and we were going to mug you before we relaxed. Oh, no. She was Okay. Great. And... I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> we're dead. Um, well, you see, there was this party, and she got married to a hooker, see, and... there was this giant robot. <laughs> uh, uh, guys, just, just fill her I make a hangover off. reference. Roll, Roll for a hangover right, reference. Alright, make your hangover reference. <laughs> we don't know what happened. We were roofied. Um, can She's, I, can, um, she is okay. not very amused at your so guys' long. attempts to, to dissuade her. Although, the, the, the being truthful with okay. her, because apparently she knows what you guys, what had happened. So she knows mo she knows something. Oh, she knows. Huh. So anyway, didn't he? I've got like three people well, talking at the same I, time. I, I, okay, hey, Des, uh, guys, you I want to say something? I didn't get I was I didn't get a chance to really say I was trying to say I was trying to say something to her, but well, go for I didn't it. get a She's, chance. She ha go ahead. Oh, She's still oh, there. Oh, I see you something else. Uh, well, well, you have to. Well, I'm kind of new. I'm kind of new in town myself, and basically. Basically, basically, um, we we've just gotten to one big old mess, and I'll say you here we are. She looks at you and says, "I'll, I'll say you've gotten to one hell of a mess. I've been hunt, I've been tracking down that operation for weeks." And her okay, so my theory and Wolfie like kind of feel her clave press a little bit against your throat a little bit more, but she's not, it's not hasn't pierced the skin, but it is kind of making you feel a little bit uncomfortable, really uncomfortable. Uh, guys? Oh right. Oh, could if you, it's any uh, consolation, we did we of... did save this guy over here. I point and I point at Stripe. Could you leave her alone and we'll be on our way? We'll totally ditch this whole operation and everything. Anyway, we'll just leave you be. You can continue your hunt, whatever. We don't want any of the trouble. 
Like, I don't even know how this all started. Right, right. <clears throat> Who has Something the about pocket the watch and Taco Bell. It's been a long, it's been a long, what, two days? And, uh, yeah, I just want to go right home. Right to I fell right on my face. All right, she kind of looks at, she looks at you all. Looks at the wolf, or looks at Wolfkin. Names. All right, I'm putting Wolfkin's life in danger here. And I'm going to take a couple steps closer to her. Don't. With my she hands glare, up. Evil, my hands she up. glares at you. Oh. Name, rank, and auspice. All of you. Now. Ah! Um, Ayanosa, um, I... warrior, and uh, rank, rank one. Rank, technically, you're, you're, you're rank one. one for all this. So, okay. My turn. Um, my favorite color lady. is blue. Wait, no, red. Uh... Lady. Uh, okay, my favorite seriously, color though. is purple. Wait, just a second. Hey, Denny, didn't I, did I, did I not get a question to um, my hunt question? A lot of people want a chance, so question. I'm giving them a little bit more chance, so we'll get back to your question. It's getting to that. I'm not going to completely okay. ignore it. It's just getting to okay, it. Okay, okay. Name, uh, buttons, rank. Uh, rank your for what? Rank is, technically, it's rank one. It's called Clioth. Clioth, then. Are we all rank ones? Ragabash. Okay. Ragabash. Oh, I'm, uh, what? Rank one. Okay, Wolf, did you oh, tell her? Yeah, I We're all. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Randomly. I'm waiting for everyone. I didn't. And, uh, oh, I just realized how yeah. awkward this is. We're all butt naked. Okay. Anyway, I didn't get to do it yet. I'm not. Okay, anyway. Okay, you're not. Up. I'm a ragabash. I'm a rag. My name's Katie, and I'm a ragabash, and uh, my Lambo is thought... blue. Dez, I thought what? you were an R. Oh, you. Your Lambo is blue. <laughs> I heard my I heard my Lambo. Yes, blue. I'm an Aru. Excuse excuse my excuse my bad excuse my bad pronunciation. It's just my whole experience has left me a bit bewildered. All right, striped. You didn't get a chance to say anything, so go ahead. <laughs> okay. Okay. Anyway, I look up at her and say, "My name is Drop Protector. I'm a Thurge, and my rank is." She kind of looks at you all. I'm a. You see her pull, the, the the clave pulls back from Wolf, and she takes a step back. I shout, now, Wolf. No. What the hell, what are you doing? No. What the hell? No. Oh, your dagger. What the hell are back you up. doing, dude? Back okay, up. what happened? Whoa. What happened, Bamboo? I'm just gonna stop. What happened? Some, somebody tackle him. I'm sorry. No, I grab both of you and throw you back. I can't take uh, me. I, I actually, I actually, I thought I, I punch you and I punch you in the face. I uh, she, neither does she. On. She kind of just me, evil and there's this small fight breaks and... out as it just kind of goes back and forth, and it just kind of resembles like the man, the one of the manga panels where there's a cartoon fight going on, and you have like three of the characters who have no idea what's going on, are just standing there wondering what the hell's going on, and she's one of the characters wondering what the hell is going on. With depression marks yeah. going on. Uh, right, right now, right now. Right now. There's a simple answer to this. Somebody yeah. just, just said, Women. now, Wolf. Now. It all just went to. I'm going to turn to I'm going to turn to her and say. Wolf. Her and say wolf. I'm going to turn to her and say, I don't know what these guys are doing. Apparently. Is what she responds with. Bamboo's um, the one that said now wolf like as if he's telling him to attack or something. And I'm, I'm like, no. And I and I and I punch and I proceed to punch I proceed to punch Bam and evil pulls both of them back for some reason. Yeah, and I was trying to like do attack and people from attacking, so, 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 so. Oh dang it. So, and basically and a base I cannot believe I just punched one of my friends in the face. Hey, it's their fault. Ow. They they tried to attack some chick. How would you just attack there. her? Well, yeah, but we don't even know what she does, what she looks like. In, yeah, indeed. Okay, Rinko. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna ask her for her name, rank, and office. She kind of looks at you. At least someone has some sense of protocol. I'm an Audrin, rank four. Uh -huh. Audrin, third. My name is Shadow. 
Oh, the fallen tribe. Shadow. <gasps> and she pulls God. her head back. She pulls the cloak back. She's got another set of scars on her other cheek. These fierce yellow eyes. And her hair, a stark white. Hair? Now, Wolf has a... Uh, Bray. I make a joke about her hair color. If you're named Shadow, why you have white hair? You guys recognize hair. the pure breed, though. In effective game terms, she has pure yeah. breed five. White Howler. The tribe that had fallen to the worm. Oh, you got a cool name. Dear God. Oh, shit. I'll be kind of honest. She's kind of attractive. Her, her appearance on the sheet is actually <laughs> no. about four. No, I'm not going to get into that shit. That's pretty good. <laughs> you got... Yeah. In, indeed. Anyway. Oh, my, I am. Might, nope. Glaive thing. My appearance is a one, so she's got it pretty good. <laughs> All right. She Sorry. All right. I'm an ugly so mobile. there's a white howler standing in front of you all. Or she's got the pure Dear breed of a white God. howler, at least. You've seen, you may have heard of some black spiral dancers right. that have that pure breed. I say, I'm done, and start walking away, away from the situation. And I start to approach her. Just sort of, just like, um, nope. I got, I everyone think everyone's that. forgotten the fact that everyone except for her is butt naked. She kind of, she's, she's actually not that unner unnerved by that. She's just kind of looking at, she's actually looking at you guys in the face, and her eyes aren't wandering. She's actually just paying attention to you very cautiously. Not and yet. Wolf, Don't provoke her. I don't like this. Oh, yeah. What were you doing? I'm saying everyone stay back. Don't provoke her. You're right not to provoke me. I haven't had. I don't have. I don't have a tribe to call my own, nor pack. But you all. Get her. <laughs> she just kind of looks at you, and you just kind of feel like you want to be quiet now. <laughs> okay. Rack Bash wants to be quiet. Oh my god. All right. Anyway. She looks at you guys. All right. Four of you need clothes. Right. Essentially, Moomin yes. of this pack, aren't I? Right. We were, we were, we were gonna mug somebody and take the clothes, but what yeah. bamboo? Come with me. What's that? Um, Denny, I want to say something. Um, she okay, okay. Said, we right? follow her. We trust her. Des. I, I suggest uh, pack. Uh, charisma manipulation. Okay, Des. Yes. Going to yes, say Denny. Slash do. Um, I asked her, well, do you know we can find some clothes? Because we were about to mug somebody before all of this. Either that or breaking our human's house. Yeah. Neither of those would be a pretty idea, good idea in the middle of the city. Come with me. Hey, hey guys. Hello. I need to close Hello. something on my computer. And I can't get to the X, X button. How do I... What do I you just click and drag the Skype thing. Or you control alt delete no, it... And bring up the task manager. Or you delete system 32. Easily does it. Task manager. Anyway, okay, you go to files. Uh, oh my god. Oh. Alright, I have to okay. restart my computer. Okay. I, 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 people are talking over you, Wolf. It's hard to hear you, so go ahead, Wolf. I'm gonna follow. Said so you're gonna follow her. Yeah, cautiously. Who else? Is, well, she starts walking. Wolfkin's character starts following her. What's everyone else doing? Yeah. Um, I'm tr I'm trying. I'm kind. I'm kind of. I'm kind of cautious, and I'm just trying. I follow you. I'm trying. I'm kind of I'm kind I'm, of cautious. I'm following, really but I'm after. not completely swayed. All whistling prophecy with striped. I'm just I'm just kind of standing there, unsure what to do, because I'm just standing there thinking to myself, Shadow, Shadow. I uh, no, I've heard that name before. Something important. Well, the pack is leaving you. In the. I start walking off in this, at a slow pace, just thinking to myself. 
you guys follow her, and she kind of leads you around back alleys, and she actually helps you kind of navigate through Seattle for a bit. Uh, you cross about two blocks, and then another half mile. While she actually has you guys, she kind of navigates you guys through there. It almost seems like time stops, or there's some kind of weird time displacement as you guys walk with her. She doesn't say much. If you guys ask her some questions, she'll answer it, but the answers are rather short and discreet. But you guys have heard rumors of someone called Shadow before. Very, almost like Boogeyman Tales. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? Don't even. Are we there yet? Bam, stop. Are we there yet? Stop it. Oh my god. And, and, and I and I grab I grab Bams by the throat and saying, "Look, man, I love you, but if you don't stop." I'm All right, slam here's the funny thing. She actually made a rage roll. At the third, are we there yet? She uh, she did get four successes because no. she's spending her willpower. But you can tell she shifts to Globro a bit. She's a little bit bulkier. But uh, who's got very high perception? Like like four or higher. Uh, perception, I have three perception. Uh, let me see. I got three. Let me look. I got a two. Perception, yeah, I got a two. Yeah. Draco. You have three? Uh, I have three. I got three. I got three. All right, I have Wolf, four. you got four. God, dang it. As you watch her, and the watch as she shifts, yeah. her clothes kind of get bigger with her. But she knows there's something wrong about her left, about her right arm. Her right arm doesn't seem to be there. Right arm doesn't be there. Oh. What? What? And you kind of remember oh. that her, she was holding what the cave the with her left hand. Ooh. Ah. Ah. And Bamboo, Ooh. the fourth time you ask, "Are we there yet?" She stops. There yet? Looks back oh. at you, and you can see that werewolf rage mm. burning behind her eyes. Yes. Eyes. And I'm kind of, I'm, I'm kind of glaring at you too. Is she a medic? Are you going to ask? Are you going to ask? Yes. I wouldn't. <laughs> okay. I wouldn't. I wouldn't right. advise at the moment. The wolf can ask. Can kind of piss the off. That could, the world that could have, that could have killed him. Are you a medic? She looks at. She looks at him. No. That, that I lost him? the arm in battle. No. no. Oh, okay. You know what? I would be stupid no. enough to try and I say, oh, her. cool, I lost a pinky toe in battle once. So <laughs> you lost your pinky toe. <laughs> and by battle, I mean sort of a uh, kitchen action. <laughs> you have sword. to, um, you have to forgive them. Sword. They're not <laughs> For being in the city is longer than I have. They're not exactly. And she right. kind of looks at you and looks at Bam. Looks at uh, Bamboo's character buttons. He's a new moon. Buttons. They're all supposed to be I like. I forgot that. about that. <laughs> His name is me. Buttons, by the way. Yeah, she looks at you, Desi. She looks at me, Danny. They're new moons. They're all like this. New moon. Oh, well, hey. oh, I'm going to apologize to her first thing. Well, she stops by kind of an old, dilapidated building. It looks like it's seen better days. But for my third years in the group, or Circuit, or circuit City, City. For your third years, oh, boy. my Here two third Wolfkin and Striped, you guys can roll Intelligence and Occult. As you guys notice, sigils and almost small totems placed around in the various shadows around the building as she comes to it. So just roll me your your wits and occult. For the other three that are kind of watching her, she pulls back a curtain that hides a hole into the wall and says inside. I I roll etiquette to politely let her go first. Let's see. Let's see how well you, roll it. Hey, roll roll me your charisma and etiquette. Roll it. Charisma and etiquette. Yeah. That's three. one, two, three, four, five, plus three. Eight. Eight. We have a, how do a I online roll? roller, I forget how to roll. which is in the chat. You roll right, right, right. as many D10s as you have points. Okay, let me see here. Yeah. Roll dice online. All right. Stripe, you better back up. 
This All right, is strike. turning what into a you, competition. What did you do? What? Well, for Chris, Remember, uh, dice oh, roll. Uh, no, no, strike. You're doing intelligence and. Two tens. Ten. Oh no, one. Number of dice roll. One. One. Right. So eight. Eight. Roll dice. Dice. Once. How many times? Three times. Once. Ten. One. Um, quick question. Um, why are they two surges since they're mystically inclined? Uh, our roll oh, is noticed crap. as I put are noticed the, the things I have sitting around the the entrance to this area. Four, uh, five, one, six, three, three, one, six. You fail horribly and she basically growls at you inside now. <coughs> yes. Now. Yes. Draco. <laughs> Since I'm trying to lose my voice, I'm going to tell you what I That's get okay. I in the it. chat below. So you got you got two successes. Striped, what did you roll for your intelligence plus a cult? Striped, what did you roll for your intelligence plus a cult? Okay, wait a minute. Like, everybody was being told all, all right, kinds of different things. Your third. So you were, you were, I asked for you to roll a, a intelligence and a cult. Okay, for intelligence, I got a six, okay, two, uh, five, and a five. Five. And for oh, okay, three. Let me see. All right, so yeah, you got, got three, three ten, and a seven. You guys notice that she has that these are very these are these are temporary glyphs and te temporary sigils she's carved into the walls, and the totems she's placed around are to ward off worm creatures. Ward off. And these are very. They're very powerful, they're potent, very but they're temporary. They're potent, but they're temporary. I, I'm going to compliment her on how well they're made. She doesn't say much as she ushers you inside after after buttons, and basically makes sure all of you guys are inside before she comes inside after you. And inside this ho this hovel, kind of little garu hole, it's a looks like a temporary home. Old mattress that's seen better days. There's a couple of uh, shelves that are in pieces. Uh, got like shelf. one working shelf, another half is broken, and they they have some talismans and some other things on there. And then off to the side, there's pile of clothes and other things that she's acquired, and, uh, and a little bit of food. It's not much. Maybe. It, I immediately right, so eat you food. get it. It's it's a can <laughs> of beans, but it, it's food, yeah. and it'll work. And she basically starts chucking clothes at the rest of you guys who are buck naked and have nothing to wear, and says, "These are, these aren't much, but they'll do." Okay, uh, get dressed. All right, all right. I'm gonna get kind of weird with this. I, I'm gonna grin. I'm gonna look at her with piercing eyes, and I'm gonna ask her, "Do I have to?" Oh God. Her response. Oh God. God. Her response is she she oh, looks God. you up and down, God. looks you back in the eyes, and says, "You have nothing to show yeah. off." Oh. What a oh, bitch. Oh, yeah. Burns. 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 Wait, what? Hey, what? What did, what did he do now? <laughs> she shrugs off your. She she shrugs off you, calling her a bitch. It's uh, what? I didn't even say that in the game. I just said that out this of game. game. This is game. <laughs> this you think this is a game, boy? I just tell her thank thing. you for the clothes and put and then put the clothes. Some on. of them are just some of them are really tight do. fit. Others are a bit loose and shrug off on you. And some of them smell really bad. I say these beans taste awful and just sort of pour them on the ground. Hey. I ask her if she okay. has any food. I could have used that bamboo, thank you very much. She evil, she hands you a can of beans after you put some clothes on. Yes. Draco. Yes. After all difficulty. Uh the ones, if you, you can know. you can find an old hoodie or something that can cover it. It's not that it wouldn't be that hard. Cover it. And you don't have a roll difficulty okay. for dressing or hiding your horns yeah. at this point. It's basically you can cover them up. Unless it becomes specifically important to a certain social okay. session, so. Okay. All right. She looks at you all. It's, this isn't much, but it's my current home, for the moment. 
So no. here's. It's so okay. I've seen worse. Are you living worse? Prior lading. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Because I was doing something. I noticed that my voice sounds like higher out of wolf. Yes, it does. Speakers. All right, Des, you were going to do something. Right, Des. Um, I said, um, I just, I, I was doing something. Uh, what I'm, what I missed. She got One you guys tangent. to her current home, which is currently a hole wall in downtown Seattle, and has offered and has given you guys some old clothes and stuff that she's managed to scavenge together. And so she sits down, she lights a fire, and the fire kind of just sparks to life, and it flashes with some, diff some different colors you're not really familiar to seeing fire doing. And she sits... I then pee on the fire. Really? <laughs> Did you just say no. you're gonna pee on the fire? No. She sits down, and she waits for you, and she kind of sits there patiently. Wait, are we setting up a camp? This is her. This is her. This is her home. She kind of lives here, and so she brought you here to figure out what the hell. And then she says this. All right. So are you going to tell me what the hell you were doing? Let me do this. Let me. Well, you see, these people. Oh, she said, "Do you have to?" Explaining how I don't know when to add clothes. I don't know when to add clothes. I am a werewolf pimp. Lie. I am a werewolf pimp. Lie. See, I'll lie. You are a werewolf pimp. Yes. Oh my god. Because, go because we are lo we are losing lie. logic in this bit. game fast. Usually, um, I'm, I'm all right, only because all right, all right, all right. there was logic. Wolfkin. All right, all right. We're gonna explain all right, the situation. Explain the situation. We're looking for some lost. Explain the situation. Yeah, we're looking for some lost wolfkin. I've been uh, been disappearing lately. Even with the glass walkers and the red talons. And she kind of. We can't search for. She kind of looks at you. Kin? You've been looking for Kin, and you track them to that building? Yes. I thought they were more professional than that. I've been tracking... They've taken They've taken more than just Kin. They took uh, an associate of mine. So I've been tracking them... And for the last couple of weeks, I've been trying to stake out their entire operation to find a way in. And that's when you guys showed up, out of the blue, and completely disrupted everything. Not to mention, send every weaver, spider, and weaver agent in the city on high freaking alert. And then I, I, I kind of jump in there and say... You gotta admit, it was pretty cool when I got shot by those boys. If it indeed gives you, if if if, if it indeed gives you a I battle scar to be proud of, then yes, by all means. Uh, no. I got, I got a battle scar for that. No, you did not. I fall asleep halfway through. I, 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 I fell right on my face. Yes, got... <clears throat> striped. Or face. Anyway, all right. I asked her what her associate's name was. I'm trying. There is. And I asked. Twelve drinks. She doesn't have much to go around. An old canteen and some water bottles she managed to scavenge. But to Stripe, she looks at you and says, My friend, my associate's name was uh, Terrence. Terrence. Okay. It was. Uh, hey, Terrence! That used to be the was, name of some pterodactyl on this game I used to play. He was a uh, former pack mate of mine. And currently, he was and is an elder within the local Glasswalkers. Oh. Got a big shot over here, huh? Now you need the help from old buttons. I tell her I'm sorry that her uh, friend has gone missing. And I offer help in finding him. I think we, I think considering, considering how things have happened, I say we all try to work together, at least for now. Oh, well, have we not been? Oh, well, have we not been? 
Well, considering well, 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 considering recent events, I could say yeah. yeah okay, I yeah. fuck up a lot. Yeah, okay, I fuck yeah. up a lot. All right, I I say okay. By a lot, I mean every time. Sure, you do. I say yeah, that we should say try that. to get some sleep. I decided not to sleep and instead play my Game Boy. You don't have Game Boy. Shut your mouth. I have a Game Boy. No, you don't. It's old and I found it on the street. And I may have punched the baby for it, but goddamn, I have hey, a Game Boy. Hey, you don't have a way to charge it. Yeah, you're right. I, yeah. I, sleep is for the week. I will stay awake all night if I have to. All right, it's all right. technically it is early morning. Early morning. And by early morning, I mean like 4 a.m. 4 a.m. Oh, that's. Oh. You guys haven't. You guys, you guys have been at this all night, pretty much. The night of the raid on the on the facility that kind of got botched, and this meeting was. I shadowed. just realized I have never gone in a werewolf form this entire time. Yeah, there's I mean, actually kind of no the only proof. Here. Are we going there is no tonight? proof that I'm just not some guy pretending to be a werewolf. Are we not going to sleep? There is absolutely no. Sleep is for Reason the week, for you man. to believe I'm a werewolf. I, I'm telling you, we need the yeah, sleep. We need where? the energy. Okay, okay, I decide to sleep. Okay, okay, I decide to sleep. Right. We all, okay. Right, we all go to sleep. But I have trouble. I take the I take the footsie pajamas, the free pairs of footsie pajamas I had in the backpack this entire this time. Got, <laughs> this, this thing got this thing got random real fast. This got exceedingly random, exceedingly really quickly. Right. I've had this in my backpack the entire time and put them on. Right, anyway. I have you are allowed. I'm having it soft. Calm down. Everyone's talking over each other again. Wolfkin? I thought he wasn't allowed to own anything. He's a. He's a bonar human. Bonar he can have like a backpack of stuff. Like backpack of stuff. And that's stuff in quotations. stuff in quotations. So it might be useful stuff. Might be useful stuff. Yeah, I've had, sure, kind of had this stuff the whole time. <laughs> My stuff, I mean, clothing. My stuff, I mean, clothing. And you, and you guys are running around naked. You just see the looks on your faces. <laughs> you had stuff this whole time. You're just now mentioning it. Uh, yeah. Come up before. Uh, yeah. What the world are you My from? Stuff. What, I don't what have world do you live in? I treat you the Taco Bell. The Taco Bell. What? I still do not like... know what this Taco Bell is you speak of. Is it Alright, a... on All right. that on note, that... as the night comes to a close, the night is still... Hey, the night to... is... I didn't even get to say what I was going to say. Well, what were you going to say? I was going to say, um, we go to sleep that night. I have trouble oh. sleeping. I have I have insomnia. My character has insomnia. Your character doesn't have insomnia. I have insomnia. Your character doesn't have insomnia. I just have trouble sleeping. Whatever. Anyway. I have All trouble right. sleeping now. All right. Right? She offers you to, she offers you guys to rest there for a couple of hours. Yeah. I would think that my child of the lion. Okay, who's going to talk? Me. Okay, Des. Okay, for okay, fine. We, I, I vote we, I vote we rest for at least a few hours, and then we work, then we work up on a way to find out what this operation is going, the sting operation they're doing here. And oh, and oh, another thing. This guy got, this guy got seriously random really fast. I think she is she really just sitting here wondering what the hell is wrong with a lot of us. <laughs> Pretty much. I was dropped on my head as a child. I'm I'm a new I'm a new to human society. I really I really I'm really just here helping really. All right, guys, can we just go to sleep? Man, you already have them. You woke up. I you guys are you guys are resting, and I'm going to end it there because it's like eight. It's eight eighteen for uh, for me. Nine. The phone call's me. getting about twenty about two hours and twenty minutes in. So too I need much longer. My video is not going to be able to upload. So. On that note, I'm going to give the people that have been here the longest, which would include Striped Evil and Dez, three experience points. Three experience points. Wolf will get two. Wolf will get two. Bamboo will get one. Bamboo will get one. All right. All right. Now for. Now for. Uh, blah, renown. Uh, blah, renown. All right, let's see. All right, let's see. 
four. Yeah. All right. All right. I want to do evil first because evil, you've got some crazy shite that happened. Um. All right. For helping out your friend escape the uh, spiders, but then also attempting to seduce an elder female werewolf. You're going to get. You're going to lose one wisdom. One wisdom. All right. I have zero. But you'll. You'll gain one. You'll gain one two honor. Two honor. Yeah. Des for treating the situation cautiously and being careful. You're going to get two wisdom. Two wisdom. But you did run from battle, so you're going to lose battle. one glory. Because <sighs> you're in our room. <coughs> Striped. You. Let's see. Get, most everyone was being very exceedingly cautious. So I want to give you. Striped, I'm going to give you two wisdom. Wisdom. And for, and for proper etiquette, I'm going to give you, give you an honor. An honor. Wolfkin, Wolfkin for, for, mm, take, for trying to take on right, an elder, elder, and losing, elder and losing and being respectful to that. Respectful to that. I'm going to give you one glory and one glory honor. And one honor. Yay. Bamboo. Actually, Dez, I gave you yours, right? Um, I got. I lost um, one I got, I lost glory and gained right. one wisdom, right? All right. All right. Bamboo. Bamboo. <laughs> for your, you attempted etiquette and failed. Failed. So you're going to get one honor. We get one honor. Hey, what? You for your okay. attempted etiquette. Okay. Oh, earlier. just for the attempt. Oh, just for, the attempt. for the attempt, you get an honor. Attempt, you get an honor. For your, your... Well, you haven't been here long oh, enough to actually get anything else beyond I... that. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Okay. All right. I've right. divvied out experience. Divvied out I've divvied out honor. Honor. And I will call it there for the night, guys. There for the night, awesome. Guys. Night. Awesome. Merry Christmas. Night.